This is a routine transcontinental small incision cataract surgery in a bilaterally blind elderly lady. So here I am doing the initial incision with my side port through the conjunctiva and watch. I first get the hold and then once I engage my crescent blade into that wound, I shift my fixation point with my limbs. So very carefully I am dissecting out the initial plane. Once I get that plane, I move into the cornea and then after all after that the movements are essentially sidewards and backwards in order to avert inadvertently entering into the AC. Very sorry that is out of the field but then this frequently happens with these patients who move their head down and since I don't want to remove my crescent plate and readjust her head or the microscope I just continue like this but then it doesn't make for a very good video does it. Here I just pulled it back. Once the uh, incision is over, I make a side port incision and then enter with the keratome into the main incision. I've already stained the capsule with trifan blue and under HPMC I'm now going ahead and making a, a large enough rexis to deliver this nucleus. So Looks like it's going on well, and that's it. The excess is complete. I then take the keratome and open up the complete incision. At this point of time, you can engage the wound with your limbs forceps. Remember, there is no bridal suture in place, and hence the globe tends to rotate. Once the incision has been opened completely, I then go ahead, do a hydro dissection, trying to prolapse this nucleus out. I got the pole, but then it went back. It's all cortex in front. So rather than uh, going on messing around there, I jump to my alternate technique. Because I put in some HPMC, take two dialers, and I cartwheel out this nucleus into the anterior chamber. And this is a very useful technique to learn. Fortunately, the patient is moving the head a little bit, so that was a little, took a little more time than usual. Then put in some posterior skeletal pressure, and there the nucleus is out, just like that. So is most of the cortex with hydro expression. Take my simco and remove the rest of the cortex. You can use the side port as well to take out the sub incisional cortex. Once all the cortex is out, I put in some HPMC and it's time to implant my single piece rigid PMMIL lens. Just making sure that to whatever extent that it goes into the bag tuck it into place, remove all the HPMC, put in my intracameral antibiotic, hydrate the side port and conclude my surgery. Thank you so much for watching.